There, James Cameron, independent filmmaker. But right now I'm trying to pay the bills, so I'm in my aspects as a chef. Well, it's half past eight, and I'm doing my bit for Earth Day 2009. And in case you're wondering what the little light is, it's my iPod. So I'm afraid the quality of this ain't going to be brilliant. Despite the fact that there are thousands of us trying to do our little bit to help save the planet, it's a Saturday night, and this is a seaside resort which means there's people out there, the town is lit up. Even now I can hear the drunken reverie coming from the front of house. So this little video is a little commentary, and I'm going to show you what this little town is like. It's now three minutes to ten, and I've finally gotten home. And Earth Day 2009 is over, for Britain at least. But it would seem that most people in this town don't care. The few little images I've shown you are just of uh, out and about. Almost every house I came past was lit up like a Christmas tree. It would seem that the people of this town are only interested in helping the environment as long as they have to do nothing more than drop a few coppers into a collection pot or watch some telethon event. If it interferes with their social life or their creature comforts, they're not interested. It's gotten to the point where it's not so much, I'm only one person, what can I do? It's rapidly becoming, well, there's loads of other people doing it, so I'll let somebody else do it for me. So I leave you with this last thought. Is your social life and comfort zones more important than having a planet that's safe for your future and your children's future?